Son of God, walking on water, raising people from the dead, doing all sorts of crazy miracles. And we, we feel like there's a disconnect from our reality. Ah, uh, that God, I can't relate to that. He doesn't really understand. In one sense, some of us, if we were honest, we'd be like, he had it easy. He's gonna die, he's gonna raise again from the dead. Like, that's cool, I gotta stay here. I'm stuck in this life. And we sometimes feel like God is disconnected from the human plight the human struggle, the human pain. There's this beautiful verse in the book of Hebrews where the writer says this, we don't have a priest, we don't have a savior, we don't have a king who, who is disconnected from the human pain, who's disconnected from, from the infirmity, from, from the tension, from, from the stress, from the anxiety. We don't have one that's not been touched by that, yet he lived without sin. And I love this because what it tells me is that Jesus is like, I've been in the human story. I know what you're going through. I felt what you feel. So when I make promises to you and I tell you what can happen, it's not speaking over your head, it's speaking right to your heart. Because I've been there. And I think in the last two days of Jesus' life, we can see some of the darkest times that Jesus actually faces. 